Hi, my name is Gina Lazenby. Welcome to my video blog. And today I'm in Chertsey. I'm with a very special person. In fact, we're sitting on a yoga mat because we've been doing yoga, and I've been with Tao Horshon. Tao, yeah. thank you so much for that fantastic yoga session. I feel, I feel great. Oh, thank you. And you know what? I can't believe Tao is the world's oldest yoga teacher. Now, I know it's very rude to talk age, <laughs> but can I share your age? Yes. 94? Yes. 94 and doing yoga. Not even doing yoga, but teaching yoga. I mean, that's amazing. So, because you are this wonderful, flexible, elegant, beautiful, graceful yoga teacher, and you're 94, you must have some secrets to share for us girls getting a little bit older about what we can do to be so flexible and agile and full of life at your age. When people aren't as full as life decades ago. I think um, most important is learning how to breathe properly. Yeah. Breathe is the life force, but it's also the creator inside of us. And if you're in touch with that power, then you're in touch with all the good things in the, in the world because it never lets you down. Yeah. So I'm not, I don't believe in allowing fear to come into my life. I start every morning knowing that it's going to be the best day um, that I've ever had and um, I expect it to happen and it does. Uh, so I, um, I don't let I don't want anyone to tell me what I can't do. Mm -hmm. I'm only interested in what I can do and, um, and what I haven't yet arrived at, but I'm going to because I'm very stubborn in life. I take this journey very seriously, but um, not serious in the way of holding tight like that, but to, to feel that there is a wonderful um, beauty within me and it can express itself. And if I can express myself, then the power of a smile always comes to the fore, you know? And that usually makes everyone else smile. So I have a lot to learn, and I'm on the same, I'm on this ladder, and I haven't arrived yet. Mm. Well, that's simple, breathing, that's simple. Yes. We forget, yeah, don't we? We can yeah. hold our breath, and yes. as you say, you mentioned about fear. Yes. We can hold on to, I mean, fear repairs when we're not breathing. That's you can just breathe it out. Absolutely. But that's a simple thing to do. And don't procrastinate. Whatever you want to do in your life, see it happening. Know that it will happen. Don't actually uh, say this is the only thing. Good things come about when you're waiting for good. Uh, if you're sitting there t thinking about all the bad things and why and wherefores, it never arrives and tomorrow never comes. One minute after midnight is already today. So you've lost a whole day. So do it right now and it, and it comes out well.